Alternatives for Girls was started 22 years ago when a group of community residents near Tiger Stadium noticed that increasing numbers of young women in the neighborhood were homeless, on the streets, and engaged in risky behavior. AFG has since blossomed into a multi-service agency that helps homeless and at-risk girls and young women make positive life choices. AFG's prevention program works with girls and young women ages 5 through 18 who are at risk for dropping out of school, abusing drugs and alcohol, and other risky behaviors. Through mentoring, after-school programs, a summer camp, girls clubs, and leadership training, we provide girls with the support and tools necessary to succeed in school, develop healthy relationships, and hone their problem-solving skills. And it works. For the last six years, 100% of the young women in AFG prevention old enough to graduate from high school not only graduated, but went on to college. My plans for the future is to graduate high school, go to college, and be a homicide detective, and then get married, and then have kids. Um, I started volunteering and mentoring because I wanted to make a difference in the lives of young women, and I wanted them to know that they could live powerfully without boundaries. We came here because we wanted to have fun, and we made a lot of friends at AFG. And we came here to learn and not to be naughty, and um, do, and do um, math and stuff and do best we can. AFG's Street Outreach Program reaches out to girls and women of all ages throughout Detroit, helping them to make more positive choices in their lives. Outreach workers go directly to the street to provide hygiene kits, food, clothing, and condoms, as well as talk to those they meet about HIV, violence prevention, health, and AFG's programs. Our peer educators are at-risk youth who reach out to educate their peers throughout Detroit about making safer choices. Outreach focuses on providing women with the tools necessary to make informed choices and reduce their risk. Um, I like when I come in, being a peer educator, I like when I come in and the first thing I say is, you know what I'm saying, how I feel. That's before we start any meetings or any paperwork or anything, I get to say how I feel and what and how my day went. And that's, you know, that's a big relief for me because a lot of school teachers don't even ask you that. So it's good to say to everybody that no matter what, no matter how hard it is, no matter if people on your back, no matter, you know, family can bring you down. And that was my biggest obstacle. My family was my biggest obstacle because I didn't know how to deal with that. But if you put your mind to it, not, not your brother, not your sister, if you, if you have the determination, you can do it. You can do anything. And I would like to share this poem with you called The Addiction, my favorite one. The Addiction. Round and round he goes, minute after minute he constantly owes. Not caring what he do, nor what path he chose. Family trying to accept without turning their nose. But they can't help it. To see their cousin, daddy, uncle, or brother so careless. Can't keep itself up cause the addiction is so tough. Red low eyes, his kids trying not to, but they cry. How sad. Doing his fatherly duties only for cash. So he could run to the coffee shop, drop a five on him, then bow down to the rock. Please stop, please stop. He doesn't listen to his conscience nor his sad and children. But why he does this, no one knows. Looking so bad, a bad path he chose. While round and round he goes. Minute after minute he constantly owes. Not caring what he do or what path he chose. 
round and round he goes, the addiction. Um, I just want to tell people that AMG has changed my life. Like, if I hadn't came here, I don't know where I would be, you know, and it, it's made me a better person all the way around from from being with my team, from meeting other girls, from learning the information that I learned to tell it to other people. It's changed me and it's made me a better person and it made me think so hard about the things that I wanted to do in life and that I wanted to help people and I just want everyone to know that this place is, is home. It's the second home to me outside of home and school and I love everything about it and I love everyone here. We, yes we are rising up Rising from the depth of our despair, where well, well, we, we are rising, women are we rising, are rising we up, rising, women are rising from. AFG Shelter Program provides a safe living and learning environment for homeless young women aged 15 to 21 and their children. It empowers young women through developing life skills, encouraging them to complete their education find a job, and form healthy relationships. We are rising up, rising from the depth of our despair. Well, we are women of the world. We're from the east, south, north, and west. We are women of the world. We're from the mountains, the valleys, the cities, and the farms. We are women of the world. Come, we're coming here with a positive mindset because the things that you get here are so much more than money. It's so much more than finding a place to stay. It's all about having the skills you need to survive on your own. I like AFG because the environment here is so welcoming and the staff and the residents, like everybody, it seems as if everyone's looking to better themselves because once you get to a point in your life and you've been through so much the only thing that you can do is go up so that never again can the truth be denied we've untied our tongues and we're speaking out. alternatives for girls helps girls and young women overcome the odds and show the world that they have the audacity to succeed